right, can a man be as glamorous as a woman? That's the big question. And now we're going to have them out in casual wear. And what we're going to do is have a, uh, our fashion consultants are here, Mickey and Myra. There they are. So, and then we're going to begin to reveal exactly who some of these people are. Were, are they men or are they women? First, here is our first contestant in casual wear, Brenda. Ah, that may look like Brenda, but I think that's Bernalisi, yes, from 1960, hailing a taxi on the Via Veneto. And don't worry, Myra, that lamb just died in the 50s. Oh, good. Thank you, Brenda. Julia. Here's Julia. Julia is also versatile in this smart Vivian Eastwood suit that will take her from the boardroom to the bedroom. Thank you, Julia. Marissa. Marissa is looking fetching in her two-piece farce outfit with the fur collar. I think a walk in the woods with her favorite nymph is what she's looking for. <laughs> Here's Victoria. Victoria is elegant in leopard. <laughs> this look puts the girl back in girl. girl. We love her. Oh, we love her. Honey, you are beautiful. And Amalia. Well, Amalia is looking fabulous in a kind of a Peter Pan goes domination. Fabulous outfit, decked with lots of gold. Definitely Peter Pan. Pan. And here is Anne. Anne will be turning heads in this chic ensemble. Perfect for that elegant cocktail. You still party. think that's, that's a lady? No, she's a lady. Oh, she's yeah. a lady. Okay. Oh, she thinks she's a man. She's a lady. Right. Coco, everybody. Coco is looking smashing in her red satin dress. Perfect for an evening of ordering in some young guy. What do you think she looks like? Mm. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Coco. There's Here's no. Kasha. <laughs> There's no mistaking the femininity of this perky, sweet, classic jumper. Tennis, anyone? I think she's ready for mixed singles. <laughs> Thank you. Christine is with us. Christine is looking daring in her retro mod mini hip hugger outfit. Ready to snag your favorite aging rock star. That's a man. I know that for sure. That's a man. And Justin! Oh. Justin is a very chic way to cover her assets. A perfect outfit for that glittering special. Sylvia! Is that Iman? I think it's a man. Oh. Here's Sylvia. Sylvia is looking just peachy in her pink wool focus wear. She's ready to be chased around the desk with that star flying. Go, go. Excellent, thank Woo. you. All right, now, thanks, uh, thanks very much, uh, Mickey and Myra. Appreciate your consulting and your, uh, your announcing on that nice little fashion show. Thank you very much. Thank you, you did a great job. Thanks. Only three of these ladies will have the opportunity to go on to the talent portion of our program. So before the show, we selected <laughs> to do talent Brenda, Marissa, and Julia, so why don't you all walk off stage and get ready for your t for your talent program? And uh, why don't why don't the rest why don't the rest of you ladies sit down, okay? And we're just going to start revealing actually who they are. You're, you're confused. Yes. You really are. Yeah. How many how many uh, women do you think are uh, up there? Yeah. Um, two. Uh huh. Which ones? The one in the pink and the one in the black. Oh, one in the pink and the one in the black. Okay. All right. Victoria. Oh, Victoria. Hi, Victoria. Tell us a little about yourself. I'm a 28-year-old Capricorn born and raised in Brooklyn, New York. I really don't have any... Right? right? I really don't have any hobbies. I just like meeting people and being a ham. Right. And... So kind of... I guess we're all, you are, you were born a? Confusion, no. <laughs> oh, man. You are born a man, okay? <laughs> and when did you decide that you wanted to live your life as a woman? Well, basically, I don't. I only live my life as an entertainer as a woman, as a professional female impersonator, and this has been happening for the past eight or nine years. And during the day, do you walk around as a woman or a man? Mm -mm, it's too hard to live as a man. I couldn't live as a woman. <laughs> oh, okay. You couldn't, you couldn't live as a woman. So you, okay, fine. 
Now, uh, here's a photo of uh, our next uh, young woman, okay? Now, that's a pretty cute kid, right? Right. Whose photo is this? Anne. <laughs> See? You were wrong. What's that? Is she a lady or is she a man? Lady. Anne? Take it off. <laughs> I was uh, born in Annapolis, Maryland. Uh, and I was born a woman. Right. All right. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Fooled you, though, didn't you? But it was the wig. I... It was the wig. Yeah. You think it was the wig. But you're not too sure it was the wig. No. Okay. <laughs> and now you don't know about all the others because you were confused by that wig. Justice, tell us about yourself. Hello, New York. <laughs> Um, I'm here from Reno, Nevada, visiting, and yes, I was born a man. So why did you choose to, to live your life as a woman? I don't. I, I, and I'm also an entertainer. So um, I do a lot of charity work and things like that for different aid foundations around and when you And you walk around during the day in your personal life? As a man. You're as a man? Uh -huh. And then at night, when you entertain, you... I do this for entertainment and for charities, yes. Okay. okay. Tasha. Tasha. Hi, Tasha. Hi. Wait a second. Before you say anything, is that a man or a woman? Uh, I think that's a woman. You think it's a woman? I see. What about the Adam's apples don't mean anything? <laughs> Tell us about yourself, Kasha. Okay, I'm from the Philippines. And um, I always considered myself as a special woman. You know, like a special man, you, you got two things in one package. Or right. You know, a woman with something extra. Right. So, so therefore, I'm born as a man. You're born as <laughs> yes. a man. Yes. Right Sometimes when you look at the wrapping on a package, you just don't do you? Mm, yeah, I know, but it's not that. I just don't. I just think um, yeah. she was. I don't know. It's she just, looks like a woman. Yeah. Okay. We've got lots of talent coming up. We're also going to reveal the rest of the identities of our women up here. A lot of people are confused. Stick around for some comedy, some singing, and a sexy strip tease right after this. Oh.